Speaking on a visit to the exercises, Polish President Andrzej Duda said Poland was aiming to build a military strong enough to deter any potential opponent. We are monitoring the situation in Ukraine on an ongoing basis. We are gaining experience there, obtaining information and taking it all into account when it comes to building the Polish armed forces in such a way that they are strong enough to deter any potential opponent. It's a paradox. We spend billions of złoty, billions of euros and dollars to buy equipment so that it will not have to be used in combat. Poland agreed the $5.76 billion contract with two South Korean companies to export tanks and howitzers, as well as other weapons including fighter jets and rocket launchers, in August last year, part of a push to ramp up arms imports amid tensions with neighboring Russia. Hyundai Rotem Company's K2 Black Panther tanks and Hanwha Defense's K9 self-propelled howitzers were shown off in a training area in northeastern Poland, close to the border with Russia's Kaliningrad exclave.